Hello, so today I'm going to be sticking this cardigan and um, this is a test knit that I have just finished for Anna Johanna. It is the Ruska cardigan um, and as you can see um, this has been completed. It has been washed and blocked. Um, I have also already picked up the button bands so I know different people do this um, either before or after steaking. Having looked it seemed like it was the better option to pick up and get these done first. The pattern does actually call for you to do this anyway. So we've got the um, buttonhole band and the button band there ready to go over afterwards. Um, I've also woven in all of the ends. Um, so when weaving in the ends if you're going to be steaking you just need to make sure that they're woven in away from that steak line so on each side respectively going um, away from the line where you're going to be cutting. And then in terms of the steak itself um, it is a five stitch um, steak section so we've got the two purl stitches um, sort of framing it on either side and then we've got three um, stockinette stitches in the centre we're going to be cutting down the middle of this green stitch so if I pull that apart that's where we're going to be chopping through afterwards so I'm going to reinforce it within each of the two stitches either side I'm going to be using a sewing machine today so I'm going to be back stitching at the beginning and then running a stitch down the centre of each of those two columns um, and then we will be cutting up the centre and then these two sections will be able to just um, fold to the inside and um, and sew those down so that they lay flat. Okay, so we've got the stitches running through the centre of the um, two columns either side of the green uh, with the back stitching at the end. So I'm just going to trim down the back stitching and then we're ready to cut. So there we go, the cardigan is now completely steaked and then we should be able to just take this band here, flip it to the inside and just sew that down so that it's not sticking out or in the way and then that is what it will look like from the front. And there we go, with the exception of the buttons, everything is all steaked and done and I have whip stitched and then um, done a more refined stitch afterwards. The um, steaked edge into the inside of the cardigan so everything is now laying flat um, yeah I've seen other people um, run bias binding or ribbon over this just to sort of like hide that edge I'm not personally too worried about it but that is an option if you wanted to um, conceal that steaking on the inside but yeah you can see that it's now sort of like laying flat and yeah ready to just have those buttons attached